Hey guys, my name is Dave, and welcome to another video. Oh boy. So a lot of recent events have been happening, and one particular topic has excessively gone through my head um, for the past about week. Before I begin, I apologize for the pause there, first of all, but before I begin talking about this, um, take everything I'm saying with a grain of salt. Because before I begin, this could cause a lot of hatred amongst those who might be owners of the kind of thing I'm about to talk about, or managers of it. I'm not hating on anything, I'm just giving my own personal thoughts and opinions on how I feel about certain choices on these fronts, whether it's law or not. Because some don't do this by law, others do. That being said, let me go ahead and get started. Recently, there have been a lot of stuff I've noticed about con er, convicts, yeah, that's not the word I meant. Evicted residents. And how they are treated if they were to return to a specific degree. An evicted resident is kicked out and not allowed to permanently live in a location. But some people I've noticed treat it like live at all. They can't spend one singular night, which is ridiculous to me. Because this kind of stuff, it what, what triggers me about it is that It's, it's like, basically, you're not allowed to invite any friends that you had who got evicted and stay, like, one night for... You wouldn't really know why. It's not like they're permanently living in the location or anything. It's just they're visiting. Why? Would you rather them sleep on the streets and then after... I don't know. Say, say it's, like, a birthday party. I have no idea. That's the first thing that came to my mind. It wouldn't be that. Uh, probably like a movie night. Say a game night. There we go. Uh, like say a group of guys are having a game night. Or girls. Either way. And all of them go home, but one. Because that one has no place to stay. And you're offering one night at your place. And that person is was recently, as of let's just say a month or so, prior to that ago, Evicted. It's one night, because he's your friend, at your place rather than their previous place. Anybody who gets mad about something like that and threatens to evict those who do that is, because I've seen this happen before, is bullcrap. Because unless, put it this way, unless you'd rather the person live on the streets... Like, because, say, they come back because they have no way of, I don't know, finding a place to stay. You're basically risking some stuff like hypothermia, for example, if it's someplace cold. Or, you could be risking actually spinal problems, because, especially for nowadays, because a lot, a lot of the street area is not natural ground. That could cause really, really bad problems if you're forcing them to just sleep outside. Like, especially when it's like during the winter, anywhere would be hypothermia. So, I mean, unless you want to be registered to pay a bigger bill, the idea of not allowing someone to stay in a different apartment with the friend that they're with is messed up. Now, that's just my thoughts. I wanted to get that off my chest. I know it was a little rant. Uh, longer than some other videos, but shorter than most. I I figured that. I, I kind of felt like I needed to say that, because it's a rant that I felt was ridiculous that a friend of mine had to actually go through. Not going to say who, not going to say why. Um, but yeah, there's that, and it's stupid. That being said, I'm going to head off. It sounds like a, friend, a couple of other friends of mine have gotten here. I want to go talk with them for a bit. For right now, thanks for watching, guys. Want to check out more discussion rent stuff or stuff about me? Two playlists on the sides here. Either somewhere here will be uh, the channel if you want to check that out for gaming or this stuff. Um, either here or consider subscribing down below, I 
there would be somewhere, if you're watching this on a TV, then it would be somewhere right here, um, or down there, if on a computer, or a phone. That being said, I'm going to head off. Thanks again for watching, guys, but I'll see you all later. Bye for now.